Hey y'all, welcome. Welcome back to my Saturday stream, Interstage Window. And uh, today we're gonna be playing some more of our hardcore WoW run. Somehow, we are still alive. This is a triumph. <laughs> I cannot believe it. Um, we're level 27. We're level 27, okay? And, um, you know, we're just gonna jump right into it, friends. We're just gonna jump right into it. Here we go. All right. Yes, we're in Stone Talon. We're in Stone Talon right now. Only goal is don't die. Only goal is don't die. Okay. Y'all let me know if the levels are good or if, like, the game is too loud or whatever. Um, just like before, I spent some time in between streams fixing up, fixing my defense. Okay, fixing my defense. Getting that last point was too hard. I gave up. Um, I got rend. I got my rend. Okay. Um, yeah. We're gonna be headed up to Stone Talon Peak today. We're gonna, um, fight some night elves. Oh, wait. Wait, let's trick or treat first. Trick or treat. Trick or treat. Jaka. Trick or be treat. Safe. What I get? What I get? Oh, I get a tree pack. Oh, I get candy bar. 3% health. Okay, it's 3% food. Yum, 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 yum. Yeah, I'll eat that. Nom, 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 nom. I have some candy. I have some candy. We had our trick-or-treating at work for people to bring in their kiddos um, last week. And my team bought too much candy. So I have some candy at the house. Uh, this was not, you know, we weren't supposed to have candy yet. I feel like I'm a little quiet. Let's turn up, let's turn up the gain. Um... And now I have candy in the house, and I have to not eat it. Because real Halloween's not until Tuesday, and we're going to give it to kids. Because I just want to, you know, I just want to do that. Mm. Why am I going this way? I should be going the other way. Also, I need my blueberry. What am I doing walking around here without my blueberry? This is wrong. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going this way. We're going this way. We're gonna get some coursers. And kill some other things in Stone Talon Peak. Many, many other things. And not die, of course. Let's buff up. I don't know what underwater breathing is going to do for us here, but you know what? I just want to be really buff. I want to be really strong. Like my hero Sylvanas. She probably can breathe underwater all the time. She never has to think about it. I bet that's true. So yeah, Stone Talon Peak should not be too bad, but... After that, we're going to end up going into Charred Vale, and I'm very nervous about going to the Charred Vale. Because it's Harpy area, and those Harpies, you know, don't have social distance. So, I'm, like, really scared. So, we'll see how it goes. <laughs> we'll see how it goes, you guys. I'm nervous. Hope everyone's having a really lovely weekend so far. I am. We're having ribs today. We're going to have ribs for dinner. Levi was just making them, putting the seasoning on. He was um, putting blackening seasoning on them. So that's really, that's exciting. I think it's going to be good. All right. Little deer, where are you? I'd like to hang out for just a little bit. Would you like to hang out with me? Oh, that's for incendiaries. We're not we're not doing that yet. I'm not worried about that yet. So yeah, we're 27, as you can see, about to sing ding 28. About to ding 28. So, you know. Do y'all think we're gonna make 30? Do y'all think we're gonna make 30? I feel like it's a possibility. It could happen here. Hey, 
Hey, I need your eyeballs and your soul, actually. Please, thank you. Yes. Appreciate you. Whee! We don't need the we don't need the thunder dinos. Um, also, uh, talents. We've improved during life and improved corruption, and then we're going demonology. Demonic embrace and improved void walkers is what we have right now. I really need to get down to demonic sacrifice, so probably take improved health stone next. So that'll be good for hardcore. Is this the type that drops? Yeah, this is the type that drops it. Not all of the sap beast um, drop the sap. Only some of them. I think it's the corrosive ones don't drop it or something like that. Right here with me some uh, some mint tea it's delicious go tong gong get him Oh, I could just look at my necrosis. My god. I know how to play my class. I know how to play my class and use the add-ons that I picked out. many deers. I don't have a target. Missed. He died too fast. I was not quick enough pressing the button. All quests should have the drop rate of this um this quest right here. The cores or eyeballs. Every single quest. Ni -na, na na Do 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 do. Get him, 
get him, get him. Level up, level up, level up, level up. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, wait. We can get our talent. Um, yeah. Right? Yeah, improved health stone. Level up, level up, level up, level up. Da 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 ding. All right, full up on souls. Thank you for your contributions. Okay, and we have all the eyeballs too. Okay, this is it, Stone Talon Peak. We are at the top of the mountain. Um, it's really grassy up here because the night elves are doing fun things. This is their area. Um, and we need to kill some of their besties. So they've got like some Cenarian kind of like peoples up here. And um, yeah, we don't like those. So we gotta get rid of them. Oh yeah, I didn't need to do that. My soul bag is full. What the heck are you doing, Karen? Get rid of that. Get rid of that nasty soul. I don't want your gross soul anyways. Devon, hello! How are you doing? I hope you're having a lovely Saturday. Yes, your table setting looked amazing. Um, when is the birthday dinner? Was it yesterday? Like, what day was it? I don't remember. Because I want to ask if she liked it. Like, how much did she love it? Because I know she liked it, because it looked amazing. These sons of Scenarius are so annoying because they come with little tree ant friends. He just walked behind the tree. He's gonna like come on with him. Tomorrow? Okay, she is gonna absolutely love it. So, um, next, I guess afterwards? Well, because that'll be Sunday, I'll stream. Yeah, so you have to tell me on the Discord then how much she liked it. I'm sure she's gonna love it. It looks so good, and you had like a cute little menu. Like, I loved that part. I loved that part. I assume you did Canva, right? There's like a Canva menu, like genius, absolute genius. Hopefully she will though, she will. It's good effort and it looked really good. It looked really cute. Like going to a real fancy restaurant. Send in pet first for the sun, because that tree ant's gonna attack too. The menu I've yet to show, I'm not sure I'm gonna to, just made it just in case. You should totally use it, okay? You should totally use it, like put it out, like lay it on the table, like on top of the plates or where the plates are gonna go, right? Um, I just think that's like the extra little touch. I know that you're like, oh, it doesn't have like a um, starter or whatever, because we're not gonna need a starter, but like, it's fine, it's okay. Like, I think it's so cute. And it really like sells the whole thing. Like that little extra, you know? So you should totally use the menu.
Oh, that daughter's gonna aggro. Knew it. Did she just get rid of my- oh my god. She just dispelled my demon armor. How dare you? That is not rude. Whatever. So rude, not fair. Should be illegal. What does Sonaria know anyway? He don't know nothing. Silly god. If he knew any good, he wouldn't be on the side of the Alliance anyways. But he don't. Okay, we need one more sun. Let's get this one. How are you doing um, otherwise, Devon? Oh, I did get some tulips today for some extra color for the table. Yes, nice. What color? What color tulips, tulips did you get? Because you had a lot of like blue stuff on the table, right? So is it like um, is it like red or yellow tulips to contrast with the blue, or is it like blue tulips? So I think tulips come in like all kinds of colors, right? I can't believe you killed my blueberry. It's totally not my fault for not paying attention. It's absolutely your fault for killing him. I think reddish, purple, nice. I think that'll look really, really good with the blue play sets and stuff that you've got. Okay, there's another daughter. Reddish, pink, okay. Yeah, I think that's good. So it like really pops against the blue. She, this one did it too. The, mm, thank God they're not, it's not choosing Ren to dispel. I would be so mad. Yes, yes, yes. I mean, I think you're gonna nail it. I think she's gonna love it, and um, it's gonna look amazing. Okay, so we've got enough sons. We just need we need daughters and botanists. What's up, ally? Fellow Horty. resisting that's so wrong she should not do that hopefully she'll love me oh my god well devon she already loves you right uh sure we can do that um she already loves you right so it's just gonna make her like fall even more okay so mr troll wants to share tags we can do that we can share tags They're, oh, they're priesty. Oh, they probably can't really get the suns. Oh, they need all four suns. Okay, let's help them. Not, not yet. What are you talking about? She doesn't love you yet. What are you talking? Is this not your girlfriend? She likes but not loves. Oh, well, that's gonna change soon. Believe it. Get ready. Get ready for love. I thought this was like your long-term girlfriend. But it's not. It's like someone you're dating. Not my girlfriend. I'm trying. <laughs> <laughs> well, you are doing you are doing good. You are doing good with your attempts. 
It will work on me, I'm just saying. If I was interested, if I was interested, it would work. If it didn't work, it would mean I wasn't really interested. But that's me, I don't know this girl. So I'm just trying to show what an actual, what's actually nice and good guy is. And if it doesn't work, that's also okay. Yeah, sometimes it just don't work out, you know. And it's just, it's just not a good match. And it doesn't really matter what you do. But I think if it's a good match, what you're doing will work. You know what I'm saying? Hello, Karen! <laughs> I can't- every time, every time. Honestly, if you're pulling out all the stops, buying her favorite flowers, keeping her favorite color... Uh... oh, you're talking- okay. If she ain't a little impressed, she's for the streets, find him- exactly. That's what I'm saying, like, if she's not- if- from what I saw of your pictures, if she, like, sees that and she's not into it, then, like, that was not gonna be a good match. Like, she was- there's, like, not really any- there's not any point in pursuing that. Because y'all are just not compatible. Because if I was in the mode of like, you know, kind of, you know, feeling it out, like into him, but not like 100% sure yet, like that kind of thing would make me 100% sure. Like, okay, yeah. You know what I'm saying? All right, that's their little camp over there. So we gotta not go over there. We gotta not go over there. So that's their little camp. Okay, is this guy done with night elves? He's done. He's got botanists. I think he probably doesn't have enough daughters. Let me ask him. Oh, we can just check. Okay, yeah, he needs daughters still. Especially if I cooks for me rather than going out to some busy restaurant. Yes, same. Yeah, if he's like a good cook, that's like that's like it. That's like okay. I'm I'm ready. Let's go. We're together now. I don't know. I, I don't know if you've been on the stream, Devon, when I've said this before, but like, I don't cook really. Like, it's just not, it's, I just don't do that, you know? <laughs> she picked the food. It's up to me to execute it. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. Challenge. You're gonna, you got this though. You got this. Problem is we're both chefs, so it's double pressure. Oh my god. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> cause uh cause I don't cook, so I don't know how to judge, you know. Okay. We both got enough night elves. Okay, sweet. Oh, I can um invis. See invis. There we go, in case- because I, I, I don't know if these kitties stealth or not, but they probably do. Most kitty cats stealth. 
she picked it and you listen, that's a green flag, to be honest, I agree. So many times I've told someone what I like and don't like and they've ignored it, yeah. Yes, yes, yes. You're so right. Oh, got our Fey Dragon Scale. Hopefully it doesn't take too long to drop for our friend. I'm such a green flag, I might as well be called Shrek, oh my god. <laughs> oh, here's a bunch of sap beasts. Man, I love being with a priest. Priests are the best. You know what's also really cool about this person? They didn't drop as soon as it was drop group as soon as it's time to do the, the drop quest. A lot of people like will not pair up for drop quests. It's like, oh, it makes it take longer. It doesn't really. They just don't, they don't understand how the mechanics work. Um, but like the perception is like that it makes it take so much longer. Like it really doesn't, but you know, you're like, oh, but you're gonna take all my drops. It's like, nah, that's not exactly how it works. Like, yeah, but no. Tell you how you don't like a food full of alcohol in it and he makes you chicken with white wine casserole. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah, why would they do that? Ridiculous. Quick answer, he was an alcoholic and put an entire bottle into the casserole. Holy shit, that's not even how you cook with alcohol. What the heck? Like, I don't cook and I know that. <laughs> what? Like, why would you put in so much that it wouldn't burn off? Like, then it would just taste like booze. Like a rum cake or something. You know, you're not, if, if it's like a casserole, like a white wine casserole, it's not supposed to taste like white wine exactly. Like, it's not supposed to, the alcohol flavor is not supposed to be there. That's ridiculous. I was sick with the flu at the time, too. Whoa. He thought it made me better. Alcohol kills the immune system, man. Yeah, no way. No way. That's crazy. I've been super addicted lately to watching um, Susie Pesto stitches on TikTok. So like, I just said crazy in my brain went, call me crazy, but I never really like store-bought pesto. <sighs> never skip a Susie stitch. Never skip. Back then, I used to react like a bull to red flags running straight for them. <laughs> I think um, I think every girly has that phase, at least a little bit, you know. It's just it's just part of the female experience. <laughs> the feminine urge to run for red flags. It's too And the girlies would come around for red flags. I know, I'm just I'm making a joke. It's a joke. It's a joke because being a woman can be often traumatizing. Um, the amount of alcohol needed to kill bacteria and such in your body when you're sick requires such a high amount that your liver is shot before you get there and you be alcohol poisoned too. Wow, really? 
That feels like a fun fact that I just learned from you, Devon. Thank you for sharing. Okay, one more sap. Then we get to kill kitties for whiskers back on the other side. The kitties are annoying because they're near the actual, like, night elf little village area where they will kill you. So I'm scared. I mean, yeah, your blood would have to be, have to almost be made of alcohol, right? Like, there's too much blood in my alcohol system, y'all. <laughs> Need more. I just heard Levi say the ribs on the smoke. That's so exciting. I gotta say, I don't love the terminology of regular green flags. While they're an easy way to explain things, it's easy to get blinded by those things and forget that some things are just what makes a person who they are, not necessarily a bad thing. Um, but some might see as a red flag true. Yeah, not every red flag um, is a red flag by itself. It's all about, like, in total. You know what I mean? Like, you should be paying attention to if you see, like, a whole bunch of them. Um, not just, like, one-off situation. Oh, no. Stoppers. Poor stoppers. Hopefully that will not be us. Oh, he only has one sap? He's not getting any saps. Oh yeah, I don't judge on the odd one or two. Yeah, I give people a chance, but if I see a massive one waving my place, I'm no longer running toward him slowly walking away. Yeah, smart. Red flag because he plays video games? How is that a red flag? I don't think I've seen that. Is that like a thing people say? Yeah, it's an interest. I thought he was done with killing daughters. Oh, whatever. Okay. I thought you had enough. Fucking normies, right? Like, I've not heard of that. I don't know, maybe I just have the right friends or something. <laughs> but I've not heard of that video game being red flag. Is that an upgrade? That's not an upgrade. Just thought it'd be an appropriate example here now. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, you know, some people get too picky also. I think some people get too picky with what they're looking for. Like, having some common interests are important, but you don't have to have all common interests, you know? I've seen TikTok mention it being red flag, like, why? At least I know he ain't out sleeping around, right? Right? They just want to eat me. Scratch me up. They're pretty though. This, um, the dark spotted pattern, this is my favorite, um, kitty cat pattern in classic.
one personal red flag, red flag is they care more about going to the gym or their skincare routine than they do about their partner. Oh, really? I'm not a gym person, but I do definitely have a serious skincare routine. I had really bad acne for a while in uh, high school. Like, I got a really bad sunburn, and it just made me break out like crazy. And I had to get, like, actual um, medicine to fix it. Like, over-the-counter stuff didn't work. And so it was really, really bad for, like, a year before I, like, completely gave up and just went to the doctor. So skincare is important. And anybody that thinks, like, once you get old, you stop getting pimples is, like, li lying to you. Like, when I was a teenager, like, I feel like people said that, but it's not true. Old pimples, too. And they're just in this little corner over here. Anything where they care more, more about anything else over their partner, I don't like. Yeah. And I think a lot of times personal red flags like that really have more to do with, like, what you've experienced in the past and what you can personally tolerate. You know, um... So, like, it might be a red flag for you because of your tolerance level of certain things that other people will be fine with it, you know? Like, red flags aren't always universal, I guess is what I'm trying to say. Sometimes they are, like, context-specific based on what you have experienced before. Unless they're being overly clingy and never give me time to do those things. Yeah, that could happen, too. And they get ignored for a few hours whilst they do those things. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that can happen, too, where they're like, oh, you're always putting video games above me, and it's like, brah. I literally never play games anymore because you say that every time. <laughs> every time I sit down to game for more than 10 minutes, like, you're in my face. So it's like, the game isn't really the problem. It's maybe jealousy is the problem. Did we decimate the kitty cat population? I feel like we got them pretty fucking good. Might have to go get saps again and wait for respawns. Yeah, I think we might have to. Tug me blind. Tug me blind. I'm sorry. We don't have the den. There's somebody... <laughs> There's somebody in general, like, just <laughs> spamming, um, that they want to do the den quest, like. I would do it. I would do it, but I'm not there yet. I do want to do the den quest. Kill me some night elves. They deserve it. Let me catch up on what y'all are saying. This is good combo. Let's take this lady right this coming over. Yeah, I was at her place. Oh. <gasps> Wailing Cavern's death at level 30. That fucking sucks. She meant her legs weren't shaved and I'm probably not going to want to look at them. I straight up told her that I don't care about that. Yeah. If you want to shave your legs for yourself, go right ahead. Absolutely. Um, but never do it for me or anyone else, especially if someone asks you to do it or add certain things. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. They should be shaving because they want to. Not because their partner wants them to. Basically, I was in a controlling relationship, couldn't play anything unless I was with him, couldn't talk to anyone unless I was there. Oh my god, yikes. That sounds fucking awful, Karen. Controlling relationships are a no-go, yes. Like, you have to be able to have, like, your own time and your own interests and your own activities. If every single one of your activities is, like, revolving with them, like, that's a problem. It doesn't really matter what the activity is. Shaving my legs is time-consuming and irritating. <laughs> I don't mind it. I don't mind it. 
Hey, got my sap. Does he still need sap? It doesn't look like it. Oh, this is a corrosive one. What am I doing? They don't have it. Um, He still needs that. I agree, Devon. You're, you're such a green flag. You're right. You're such a green flag. You're shy. Okay. So we'll loop. We'll loop back around to the kitty cats. Because we totally did decimate the cat population. We killed them all. And we need more wee scars. I'm so nervous, guys. Once we finish getting our whiskers, it's time to go. It's time to go to the uh, to the charred veil. I don't want to go. I don't want to go. Yeah. I was in a bad spot mentally and physically. Ended up stuck until I got strong enough to beat him on side. Honestly, oh yeah, that can happen sometimes. Like circumstantial, you just can't get rid of them. You know. He couldn't understand why I want to do my own thing now. And then, because he only ever wanted to do things with me, I told him that's not even love, that's obsession. And he switched to gaslighting. Yikes. Yeah. Um, see, and I just don't believe him. You know what I mean? Like, when people say, like, they just don't feel that way and they do want to do, like, every single little thing with you. Like, I don't think that's true. I don't think they're telling the truth. Like, they don't really want to do every single little thing with you um, and not have any time on their own. They've got, you know, issues with control and things like that, you know? Um, that's what it is. How dare you attack me? They don't really want to spend every waking moment with you. What they want is for you to not spend any time without them. Like, it's a different, it's a different desire. I mean, it causes that behavior, but like, I just, I just don't think they're telling the truth. Because I don't think anyone wants that. Anyone doesn't want to be partnered up 24-7 all the time. They just want to make sure you aren't sleeping around behind their back when usually they're the ones straying, yeah. Like it's like a it's like a guilt thing or like a jealousy thing or whatever. Oh, that's so nice, Devon. My hair is always greasy. I use dry shampoo. <laughs> secrets, secrets revealed. Secrets revealed. You really shouldn't wash your hair super often, though. Like, um, it shouldn't be washed every day. Like, if you're showering every day, you shouldn't be washing your hair every single time you shower. It should just be every couple of times or or something like that. Because it makes your hair produce more grease. Um, so I just use dry shampoo a lot. So that I don't have to feel like I have to wash it every single day. I found out that he had been flirting with every other female in the Twitch community. Oh, fucking course. We were in and zeroed in on me, the most vulnerable of them at the time, and didn't find out until I got rid of him. Oh my god. Honestly, that sounds kind of familiar. There was this dude that, um... There was this dude that, uh, that recently, like, deleted his Twitch, deleted his Twitter, deleted everything because he got found out. Um, he was married, and he got found out, like, flirting and sexting and stuff with, like, basically a zillion other women, and he was lying to all the other Twitch ladies um, that they were the only one he was cheating on his wife with, but it wasn't true. There was like five of them. Um, and he's not here anymore. <laughs> like everybody was like, what is wrong with you? Da 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 da. Um, band together around the girls. And um, basically like he deleted everything out of shame. It was insane. on the rest of the girls too if they knew he was married shame on them for going along with it yeah well there was various levels of lies to the girls various different levels of lies to the girls to get them to do it or not do it some of them needed more lies than others i'll just say that some of them needed to be told more lies than others but like you know ultimately he's still the one married and cheating so he's more in the wrong but yeah there's a lot of shady shit And he was in a lot of the same, like, streamer network and people that, like, I typically watch on Twitch. So, like, I would see him everywhere. And, uh, and yeah, so it was crazy. Cook, 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 crazy. 
The point is, just don't lie. Just don't lie. Like, just be honest. Is the whole point. Especially when it comes to, like, um, romance and sexual stuff. Like, just don't lie. Speaking of marriage, she has been on a few dates with someone else before I asked her out. Oh, this girl that you're gonna see, okay. And I knew that guy and I also knew that he was married. I had to tell her, oh my god, she didn't, and she didn't know. It was like news to her. That's fucked up. Hello, Salty, hello, welcome in, welcome in. I don't know how someone can take, can be fake to someone knowing they're doing inappropriate stuff with their partner behind their back. Like, how can you fake a friendship only to get to their partner? It's weird. Yeah, that's super weird. That's super, super weird. I'm not afraid. Turns out he was harassing some girls in the community, and I hated that friend and his music I don't associate with deviance. Only good kind of deviance, right? Only, only the good kind of degenerates. How are you, by the way, Salty? Are you are you in here? Um, did you come join in uh, for the the sweet sweet wow content, or did you find me some other way? She had no idea and was quite devastated. Oh God, to the point where I actually called him to confirm he was married. Yeah, no fun. Yeah, that is terrible. Crushing. I feel really bad for her. Finding out a shitty way. Only the good kinds, anyone that's bad kind needs to watch out. Come for me all you like, leave my friends alone. Yes. <laughs> yeah. I got suggested via YouTube. Oh, and then follow the Twitch link because it's better viewer experience. I agree. Thank you so much. I just started recently streaming on both YouTube and Twitch um, exactly for what you did. So this is exactly what I was hoping for. I've been wanting to stream on both for so, so long because YouTube has the better discoverability. And now, since TwitchCon, since they have announced officially it's okay to restream, now I am very publicly uh, streaming on both. So um, I'm so glad you popped into my Twitch. Thank you so much. And I'm so glad Twitch, um, Twitch put on their big boy pants and realized that like trying to force people into exclusivity is not going to do anything to help their platform. It's just going to make people laugh at their platform and eventually like slowly kill it. So I'm like really, really glad that, uh, that they're doing this. Oh, he has the dragon skill. He has dragon skill. Um, oh, we're back to these guys. Okay, wait. We need more kitties. Here, kitty, kitty. They probably realized that when a lot of their streamers were going to kick and said, I think that's exactly what it is. I think that is exactly what it is. Kick was cutting people really sweet deals. And um, Twitch was like, oh shit, oh shit. We have real competition now. Um, all of our, you know, certain type of streamers are going to go to kick. And that's a big market for us. And oh no, oh no, we're scared. And so they were like, okay, okay, okay. You can restream now. <laughs> you can simulcast now. It's okay. We, uh, you can simulcast. And I think their rules are pretty fair. Like they're really just trying to say like you can't, they don't want you to use Twitch to drive people to other platforms in the middle of your stream. Like they still expect you to be like, hey, come on to Twitch because we have the best community, which is true, they do. Um, but, uh, but they're not gonna stop you from streaming on both. And honestly, the rules that they set out for like how to do it and all that stuff, it's not, um, it's not enforceable, so it really doesn't matter. Like, the, they're effectively just guidelines. So it's, like, really, really nice. I'm so, I'm so glad. I'm, like, so glad there's not that drama anymore. Oh my god, I can't type. It took me, like, three tries to type the word sap. I found most YouTube streams have been in our rubbish for chat interaction. They are, because, and it's not just because the streamers are bad. It's because, um... It's because the uh, the YouTube like chat experience, like there's no channel points, for example. There's no um, there's just no interactivity, you know. There's no interactivity in the way that there is on Twitch, so it's very very hard to build like 
um, loyal, fun, interesting chatters. Whereas on Twitch, because there's there's channel points and uh, and you know a really a lot of nice chat bots and things of that nature, it's so much easier on Twitch to build up a group of chatters that's really fun and interesting. Whereas on YouTube, like I could never imagine in a, going in a YouTube stream and like chatting with the other chatters. You know, I would only ever be chatting with the streamer. But on Twitch, that's not true. On Twitch, I will often be addressing and discussing with the other people in the chat. You know what I'm saying? And that just doesn't happen on YouTube. It just doesn't. So it's just a completely different community. It's a completely different experience. Um, and I absolutely prefer the Twitch chat experience, 100%. Like, I've tried a couple times to watch YouTube streams, and it's just like, it's okay, but it's not that great. I love interacting with other chatters. I've made some amazing friends doing that. Exactly. Exactly. And then, like, you see them in other people's streams and stuff. Um, especially if you're going into the same categories a lot, so it's, like, really fun. It's too far away. On Twitch, that is, yeah. On Twitch. I should probably actually, I should probably actually look at what's going on in, in the restream so I can see the YouTube chat. <laughs> oh, but I can't scroll in there. That's why I clicked back over to Twitch. That's why I clicked back over. If people are chatting in YouTube, I'm sorry. Come hang out with me on Twitch because I'm not watching. I'm not watching the YouTube chat. So yeah, I think you're going to see a lot more people, a lot more Twitch streamers also streaming on YouTube, but like not really interacting with YouTube, really just using YouTube's discoverability to drive people on over to Twitch. I love introducing my friends to other streamers that I love watching because I like my friends to all be in one place. Yes, so I don't have to segment my time between communities too often. That's energy I don't have right. Exactly. So if you have, you know, like, oh, this group of streamers, I see the same people in them all the time. Like, that's good. And that's awesome. Oh my gosh, thank you so much for the follow. Thank you so much for the follow, friendo. Um, I really, really appreciate it. Thank you so much. Uh, salty. Separated from my friend. I coming back. I coming back. Salty, by the way, um, I guess I did. I haven't told you yet. What other kind of stuff we do? So, um, we stream a lot of games from like the '90s and early 2000s. That's kind of our vibe here. Um, so when, of course, when classic, uh, War World of Warcraft dropped the hardcore, um, as the as the thing. I was like, ooh, this is the opportunity to show all of my friends WoW, which I probably have spent more hours on than any other game ever in my whole life. <laughs> um, you know, so, uh, so, so yeah. But uh, other games we play, we play a lot of Sims 2, and we have 100% runs of a couple of different, like, of that era games, Final Fantasy X. Um, we have 100% run of uh, Majora's Mask. Uh, I also have a, a Nuzlocke of Leaf Green, a Pokemon Leaf Green that I did. Um, Let's see what else. We also do dating sims sometimes. Like we're actually gonna do a dating sim tomorrow for a home. We're gonna do um, Monster Prom to Monster Camp. Uh, so that's like the kind of stuff you can find on my channel. In addition to that, we do a media analysis podcast once a month-ish. Um, like the last one we did was comparing the uh, Little Mermaid live action remake to the original Disney animated. Um, we've also gone through all of the Hunger Games books, all of the Harry Potter books. So there's a ton of that content on my YouTube channel as well if you are interested in any of that stuff. Oh, and we're playing through Final Fantasy X-2 as well. That's honestly our main game, but we're, we're taking a little break from it because we just beat it. And we're trying to do 200% though, so we're gonna do a new game plus and probably a second new game plus as well. Um, we're about to start our first new game plus in a couple of weeks. Once we're finished with our little break. I mean, when I met you, I didn't even know you streamed. True. We met purely through roleplay side of things, and honestly, I was too scared to talk to you for some reason. Why? Oh my god. Am I really that intimidating? I feel like a bunch of people tell me that. Like, they don't want to talk to me. I'm like, why? 
<laughs> I don't care about anything. I'm like really super chill. But I think because like those those roleplay videos, like because I have like I've been doing it for so long, I have very specific strong opinions and reasonings behind those opinions. I think people are like they think I'm like that about everything, but I'm really not. <laughs> yeah, I was watching while related videos when I saw your stream. I love Wow, my favorite Final Fantasy, of course, is 10. Of course it is, Salty! Oh my god! Salty, how have we not met before? We should be best friends. 10 is the best. Don't go up there, there's fucking- there's elites. What are you doing? What are you doing? Why? Why? I'm taking a break, a little go- oh, okay, okay. Thank you, thank you for the group. Okay, we don't have to finish helping them then. We can just go to the Charred Veil, which I'm scared of. Um, yeah, 10 is the best. 10 is the best. I absolutely fucking love Final Fantasy X. Makes me cry in multiple spots. Um, so yeah, I have a 100% playthrough of that. And, uh... And yeah, it's literally my favorite. Like, I told the same thing. Apparently I intimidate people, but I have solid mommy vibes, apparently. I think that's what it is, girl. I think we both... I think we both have that. Um, it's the mom vibes. It's the mom vibes make people scared. And I'm like, I can't really help... I can't help what I am. <laughs> I can't help what I look like, you know what I'm saying? Um, you know, just this, this look just, you know, <laughs> the internet only likes certain categories. What am I, what, what can I say? Um, I don't remember why I came in here, but I do remember I saved your butt not long ago with the microphone. Yes, you did, Devon. Devon, I think you had lurked in here before, but you never really spoke very much until I had all those audio issues during the first, um, hardcore WoW stream and you fixed it for me. And, uh, and that's, I think, how we started actually talking. <laughs> Mom vibes are nice. Thank you, Devon, because I know that's what I have. I don't even know what you look like. Most most don't know what I look like. It's personality type. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't even... It's, I think so. And I, Well, I think, like, the look means that I know that's my vibe and, like, where I fit in. And so, like, I just do it. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so I'm supposed to just go in there, but, like... Holy crap, my bag is full of nonsense. Like, what is all this? What is all this and why is all this? How in the heck is all this? Okay, I can disenchant this ship. So I think I have to go... I think I have to go turn in. Or sell shit. I have too much stuff! What is this? Yeah, I have to go sell stuff before we go in there. So I'm gonna run out of bag space. Good thing y'all don't know what I look like. I look like a Freddy Krueger had a hate child with an avocado. Devon, I don't believe you. Um, I got some looks today, went out shopping. I dyed my hair black again and found the perfect super pale foundation to match my skin. Fuck yeah, goth vibes. Um, I was on full gothic makeup, loved it. Others were like, what the fuck? Yeah, everybody, but everybody loves goth mommy. Okay, everybody loves goth mommy. Lulu, we stan. Imagine Freddy Krueger and Deadpool having a child and being birthed by an avocado. Devon, I don't believe you. You look like Deadpool, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I think that's more. And it's like, it's vibes too, you know? It's not just like pure looks, it's vibes also. So yeah. <clears throat> and Devon, I will tell you, I'll tell you secrets. I'll tell you secrets. Like there's a lot that makeup and a good camera can do. A lot. <laughs> a lot. I have a floor-length gothic dress arriving soon. Fuck yeah. I'll be even more goth mommy when it arrives. Oh my god. Oh my god, girl. I know you don't you don't really use cam when you stream or whatever, but like Lulu cosplay stream when. Lulu cosplay stream when. Um like <laughs> I feel like you could rock that so hard. You know when we had our um Halloween thing this week, uh our work Halloween party, and my team was Barbie. As y'all know, if you're in my Discord, our team was Barbie. And I was um, uh, like a Christmas Christmas party, like holiday party Barbie. Okay, so I had like this pink sweater dress or whatever. And I have, I have a blonde wig. I have a blonde wig that I bought before for uh, Luna 
cosplay when my team was Harry Potter for our theme for Halloween. Okay, so I had, I had a blonde wig already and I wore that. And oh my God, with the holiday dress on, with the holiday dress on, the amount of coworkers that were like, they would, they would look at me and they'd be like, you should go blonde. <laughs> the amount of people that were like, girl, you should go blonde. They didn't say that when it was Luna. They didn't say that when it was Luna. But when I had my sweater dress on, when I had my pink sweater dress on, I'm just saying, I'm just saying, maybe I should, maybe I should get like some, some like strawberry blonde dye and put it in my conditioner. I don't know. What if, what if crazier things could happen? Our dress code doesn't allow us to have, um, unnatural hair colors, but strawberry blonde's a natural hair color. It'd be kind of close to pink. I, I want pink, but I can't do it. The only hair color I don't rock is brown, which is funny because that's my natural color, girl. <laughs> yeah, but brown's most people's natural colors. But I know why the blonde looked good on me because when I was born, my hair was, was blonde like that and it's gotten darker as I've gotten older. So now it's like light brown. Um, but when I was first born, it was like blonde, blonde. So like, I get it. I know why. In the UK, they le they legally can't dictate your hair color anymore. They should have that here, because it's stupid. I can only cosplay as a Michelin Man or a Stay Puff Stay Puff Marshmallow Man. Both excellent cosplays, Devon. Both excellent cosplays. Glory okay. To the I need to sell shit. Take these large slimy bones, please. I don't want them. So much crap. So much crap. Why do I have so Farewell. much crap? Okay. I'm dressing up as a plumber tonight for Halloween party, like a Mario plumber or like a plumber plumber. Another team at work was Mario. They looked so good, y'all. I've had blue hair twice in my life. Once was lagoon blue, once was dark powder blue. I've never done blue. I've never done blue. Um, but I've done like, I, I did actually, I dyed my hair like red, like various reds for several years. And I rocked that, it was good. Like to the point where where if, I, if the red wasn't too crazy, which sometimes it was, sometimes it wasn't. Dying your hair red is like beating a dead horse. You have to, it's like so, you just have to do it over and over so often. But anyways, um, if it was like a more subtle, uh, subdued red that I got that time that I went, people would think it was natural because I'm like super pale. So they would like think it was, but it was, I usually had more like daywalker red, more like red, red than like actual hair color, red type of red. You know what I'm saying? I've done most colors now, even green. Oh God, I would be scared to do green. I would be scared to do green. You're strong. You are strong. I would do blue though. I would do blue, purple. I think I would really try anything except for green. Before I went back to back, I've been dyeing my hair purple, but it's so much maintenance. Yes, purple's the same way. Like it just doesn't stick. Red also just doesn't stick. You have to do it so often. Hello, Lisa Phillips. Hello. Welcome in. Welcome in. So happy to have you here. Um, how did you find me today, Lisa? I'm doing really good. I'm not dead yet. I'm not dead yet and I'm level 28. This is officially the farthest I've gotten with um any character so far in uh, in hardcore so i'm um, i'm super excited that it, my stream character has gotten the farthest we're gonna see if we can get to 30. we're gonna see if we can get to 30. i don't know um happy saturday try a combination of yellow and blue devon devon please please happy saturday lisa are you having a good Saturday? Which games do you stream the most? Um, probably Sims 2 and um, Final Fantasy. Like we have 100% playthrough of Final Fantasy 10. We're currently working on a 200% playthrough of 10 2. And I have the Pixel Remasters, which I plan to play on stream as well. And then Sims 2, we have a Legacy Challenge, which we're on Generation 6. And we also play Pleasant View Rotational. So those are probably the two most common games on my stream. 
But um, we play a lot of like games from the 90s and early 2000s. That's kind of the era, hence the World of Warcraft. Um, we have a 100% playthrough of Majora's Mask also, for example, as well as a Nuzlocke of Leaf Green that we did. So that can give you some idea of the games you can find on my channel. Bright colors are easy to maintain for people with naturally light hair, but I had to bleach my roots every two or three weeks. Man, it's just not the vibe. Yeah. Where are you from? I'm from, I'm from the U.S. of A, Lisa. I am from the United States of Americas. Okay, here we go. We're going into the scary place. The charred veil where the harpies are all closed together. They don't know how to social distance. This could be it for us, you guys. This could be it. There's a lot of scary shit here. There's a lot of scary shit here. Thank you for stopping by, Devon. It's always fun to hang out with you. I'm a graphic artist and I work with streamers and gamers. If you don't... Oh. Oh. Why do people do this? <laughs> Why do people do this? So silly. Don't do that, y'all. Don't do that. Don't come in here and tell me my graphics look crap and you're gonna fix them for me and I'm supposed to pay you for that. Like, just don't. Just don't do that. If I want to buy graphics, I will go on Fiverr or uh, Twitter slash Blue Sky and ask for graphics artists looking for commissions. That spell is I do not need you to come into my Twitch and advertise. You are free to make me graphics for free and then send them to me. Um, if you would like to do that, you can totally do that. You can just make them and send them to me. You do not need to talk to me about it. Um, but no obligation for me to use them, of course. Is this wand better than my wand? No. Shame I couldn't ban them myself. I love banning people. <laughs> All right. Have a good day. Have a good rest of your day, Devon. Better mask up. Why am I masking up? I ain't got no vid. You said they don't st oh 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 my gosh i forgot my own joke yeah we haven't quite gotten there yet but they don't welcome by the way um flebson welcome how did you find me um i see your first time chatter are you here for the wow are you here for the world of the warcrafts the warcrafts world yeah we're about to be there we're about to be there you're so right we have to mask up we have to mask up you just died? Oh no, I'm so sorry, friendo. We're, we might just die here. I'm really scared. Um, this is the farthest we've gotten, was my stream character. I had a druid that I played off stream and then I died and then I remade her and then I died again, um, both in the 20s. So if we can get to 30 with my stream character here, I would like be so elated. I would be so elated. But I don't know if it's gonna happen. Because these guys, like, these harpies, you'll see when we get there. It's just like in the barrens, when we fought the harpies and the barrens, like, all fucking so close together. Like, why? Like, why do they stand like that? How far did you get when you died? Like, what's the farthest that you got it in hardcore? I'm out of range. Oh yeah, this bitch is immune, that's right. Oh, he's immune to this wand, too? Oh, motherfucker. It's a fire wand. Level 27? Yeah, that's about when I keep dying. Like, the, the mid-20s. The mid-20s. Lunar! Lunar with the first! Yes! Nobody had gotten the first yet. Welcome in, Lunar. Okay, before we go into this super scary area, just to make sure I'm, like, super on it, I'm gonna, I'm gonna just, I'm gonna pee and have, like, a really big swig of my, of my drink here. So, um, yeah, we're gonna log out real quick while I do that, because I don't want something to come attack me while I'm in the bathroom. Hello, hello. How is your Saturday going, friend? How is your Saturday going? It's mint tea, by the way. It's so delicious. How are you feeling? I know you've not been feeling too well. And while you're answering, I'm just gonna go pee. Like, two, I'll be back, two seconds. Don't go nowhere, you guys. I'm so fast at this.
All right, y'all want to pee, pee fast like me? Do your Kegels, kids. So fast. Died in Duskwood. This mob stunned me for 10 seconds, right? As two other mobs respawn the same time in aggroed. That's a bitch. That's a bitch. Um, how do you say your name? Flebson? Is Flebson good? Am I saying that okay? Correct, correct me if you want me to say it different. Okay, here we go. We might die. We might die. So wait, you play Alliance? I'm sorry that Alliance stinks so bad. Um, and that none of them shower. Um, you could come and play on Horde, where we don't smell so bad. Okay, wind callers don't need this. It's Flebs in, which is sort for flebs.net. Ooh, Flebs. Okay, Flebs in. Understood. I got it. They stand so fucking close together. And these little, like, clusters. Why? I do shower, so maybe I should switch to Horde. Right? That's what I'm saying. Like, I mean, I just... I know how Stormwind smells. I, like, I just... I know. It's going well. And I feel 100% migraine broke last night, thankfully. Thank God. I was I was nervous about you when you said, like, you had had a migraine all day. I was like, I hope she sleeps it off. You know, often that's what you have to do. I have to get up. means I have to get up and switch the TV back on. Oh, my God. <laughs> that sucks. That sucks, but you can do it. Oh, wait. Let's wait. Let's make a party. Let's make a party. For killing these harpies. Oh, he declined. Okay. Whatever. You don't want to be harpy killing buddies. That's fine. I don't know harpy killing buddies, I guess. I'm just really scared. Well, you can do it, girl. You can do it, Karen. You can get up. You can turn on the TV. Just say one, two, three, and just go do it. So one, two, three, and just go. And then you've done it, and it's all good. Is this blue one? Oh, no, that's the elite. Run, 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 run. I do not want to be in the path of the elite. Okay, we do need that ambusher, though. I did it, and the game installed. Yay! It recently became full crossplay compatible, so I feel it's time to return. It's definitely time to return to that point. Because you know it's going to have an influx of new players if it just became cross compatible. So you're totally right. Oh, wait, maybe. Do you want to be friends? Yay! They want to be friends! His name is Home Tanks. Oh. This bitch! Excuse you. Finally. God, that took forever. Nice interrupt. Nice interrupt, Shammy. It's more I only played it with aforementioned X, and so the clan I put so much work into ended up just me and all my other friends are in different platforms. Oh... Oh no. Oh, that sucks. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Well, hopefully, you know, now that there's um, there's an influx of people and all that stuff with the cross-platform, you can find a new clan that's poppin' and X-free. And you can have so much fun. I'm glad I have this Shami friend to protect me here. I don't feel so scared anymore. I've got this big strong Tauren with me. I'm not leaving my own clan. My friends will be able to join mine now that there's crossplay. Oh. Okay, okay. I don't really know anything about this game. So, like, I don't know how, like, all that shit works. You know what I'm saying? But I'm so happy for you then that you won't even have to lose your clan. That's so good. 
Yeah, I don't know anything about Warframe. Except for that's the game that um, Almanax is always like, hey, when are we going to play Warframe together? And now I can ask him when we're going to play WoW together when he pops into the stream, which is very fun for me. Oh yeah, I can't wand him. Such a shadow bolt. Shadow bolt, shadow bolt, shadow bolt. I'm attacking the darkness. <clears throat> The clans are like guilds, you get a clan dojo and a, like a guild hall. I put so much work into my jojo. So much game currency and materials. Yeah, you would not want to lose a, a guild hall. Like, holy crap. That would be so much work. That would be so much work. So I totally feel what you're saying. WoW doesn't have really have guild halls or anything, but I've definitely played games that have them. Um, so I know what you mean. You would not want to lose that shit. Man, we cooking with grease now. We cooking with grease, we zoom in, we ain't got nothing to be scared of. Absolutely nothing. Show me OP. It's the same with FF14 free companies. Yeah, I had to start all over once just because I needed to move servers to get away from some toxicity. Oh god, that sucks. They don't have cross server um situation in uh in 14. I don't really know. I mean, I played through the- I did have 14, and I played through the story up to what was free. At whatever point that was- it was a couple years ago, so I don't know, like, what's free now, but it's whatever was free then. And, um, it was good shit. But, like, I never, like, joined a guild or raided or, you know, did any of that. I just played the story. They didn't, then they do now. Much you can't join their free company if they're on a different server. Oh, I see, I see. So kind of, sort of. See, see how close all these harpies are? But these bitches do not know how to social distance at all. You can add them as a friend at least. And they're even cross data center now too. Oh, nice. Yeah, in Classic Law, you can't, there's no cross server or anything like that um, for hardcore. It's just the two servers and you can't cross them. But um, the regular Classic, the non hardcore, does have clusters. So, like all the Northeast, um, like Northeast servers are grouped by time zones. So, you can do that. Slayers are really dangerous if you fight them while you have low health. They'll like destroy you. Warframe, they had a cross platform play, but you couldn't add as a friend or to the clan. Only just add the option to add as friends and join clans. That's why I said it pulled up its big boy pants. Oh, <laughs> nice. Well, I'm happy for you. I'm happy for you that you in that you now don't have to like lose all that work.
And we gotta go all the way around to get rogue feathers too. Ugh, you gotta go so far into this thing. So annoying. And we're gonna have to come back here to do the seeds like what he's doing right now. We didn't turn that in, so we don't have it. But you have to come back here anyways to get more harpies after you get these harpies. So we'll do the seeds at that point. I'll protect you, friend. I'll protect you. Is this rogue feathers over here? In this little cluster? Maybe. Oh, you came from so far away! What's wrong with you? I was minding my own business. Excuse you. What is that? Oh, they're a night elf. They can't they can't be friends with us. I thought I saw another friend, but no. They stink. night elf this arm mound i don't know if alliance even has that quest <laughs> i don't think alliance does that well they kill harpies but i don't think they do the regrow part well, maybe they do i don't know because that is kind of night elfy so they probably do get the same quest from the little night elf hub up there dead. killing so many and the storm witches too I feel like that popped fast are there enough people here that hyper spawns turned on Mm. I need to get 
sir. I'm out of range! Okay, so I've just got the groups in the back for me, but I think my friend here needs more ambushers. Well, where is he going? Oh, Urban. <laughs> he got the bruise weed. Okay. All right. Where'd the elite bitch go? Oh, I think someone killed her. Oh yeah, she she's dead. She's dead. Okay. So she's not a problem for a minute. Why are you ghost wolfing it? I can't wolf out with you. Sweet. So we just need rogue feathers now.
a couple of um fly fire elementals are up. Okay. I know. Get some incendiaries. I feel like when we walked back by here before, people had killed them all. Oh yeah. Keep trying to wand him. I have a fire wand. It's not gonna work. Oh, my God. Wand you, furious stone spirit. Gosh, the rogue feathers are just not so plentiful.
That was too big of a pull. That was nerve-wracking. I don't like that. I don't like that. Whew. Dangerous. Okay. No, well, we got the rogue feather. There's another one over there. We just need one more. Aw, oh, thank you. Thank you for the heal. Appreciate you. Alright. Got all the harpies. Now we just need incendiaries. Hell yeah. Wanna go to next part? Yeah, um, but I need... Also. Yeah. Hopefully they'll be cool with like killing more elementals and then going doing the next part together. Yeah, I need six more, you need four. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. That is true. I guess the best thing to do would be to just run back and forth across the back here until the elementals spawn. So there's clearly other people doing circles and killing them too. Just like we were. <clears throat> Too bad we don't need the stone spirits for anything. We just need the fire ones. And I want to go fast. I want to go fast like Ghost Wolfie. Warlock is a um, utility class. I should have go fast spell. Robbed.
I guess this place isn't so scary when there's tons of people here, but still, these harpies are too close together. It makes me so nervous. Oh, he found one. What is it, Queen? Yeah. You help the elementals spawn faster? It, thank you. I, I appreciate your vote of confidence. Just a lot of people here killing him, you know? So it's taken a minute. Hello, baby. Hello, baby. Queen is my black kitty cat. You can't crawl in my lap right now. You give me kilt. I love you though. Go ask Levi for attentions. You think with them getting genocided, the server would spawn them faster? Yes, I would think so. I would think so. If there's this many people here killing them, they would hype start hyper spawning. They should hyper spawn. I agree. We're gonna go check the spawns up in the little north passageway area, guys. Hopefully I can catch up, because there might be some up there. Okay. It says there's some up there. On my way! On my way!
Dang it. Didn't mean to aggro the harpy. Little elemental. It keeps having me skip it. I don't have enough incendiaries yet, but the the little tracker thingy thinks I do. So weird. I need two more. I need two more silly little tracker. That's my toe queen. Please don't lick it. Do y'all's cats like <laughs> stick their face up in your toes and like lick them and sniff them? Mine do. It's so weird. Queen and Oreo, that's their thing. At least their 100% drop rate, saving grace on this quest. I wonder if like the tree ants and the uh, rock elementals are like placeholder to the fire elementals. Probably not. Probably not. I mean, I know the tree ants are used for an alliance quest, but I don't think either either alliance or horde has a uh, quest for killing those. Uh, stone elementals.
Oh my gosh, Kendra, hello! Doing moving stuff, but real quick. Real quick what? Real quick what? How are you doing today? I didn't realize the move was going to happen so fast. I guess it's happening this weekend, or are you just preparing? Did you know the Mortal Kombat theme is actually a church hymn from Scandinavia? What? What? Are you kidding? I've never heard this. The dun 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 that? Mortal Kombat! It's a Finnish hymn. I almost don't believe you. That's crazy. That's crazy. I, I did not know. That is a brand new fun fact for me. What moving stuff are you doing? Is it just like preparations or is it like... Or like you getting... Started. Say, say it again. Mortal Kombat? Finish him. Oh my god. Fucking Kendra. Kendra. Kendra! Please. Is that what I should be saying, by the way? I think you know what I mean by that question. I know you said internet thing, but I don't know if Twitch counts as internet thing. We're clearing out the basement. Oh, okay, okay. So basically you're clearing out your storage area right now. Makes sense. Makes sense, makes sense. Oh my god, fine, I'll kill you. Oh, at his parents? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Okay, so you have space to move into. I assume that means everything went well with the conversation with the with the parents, with the in-laws. His mom is two degrees from being a hoarder, so oh, oh no, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Well, then you're doing her a big favor by helping her clear out her shit. We have to clear out the space we're going to. Yeah, that makes sense. It's all good. Oh, good, good, good. I'm so glad that you you have um, those in-laws to fall back on in this situation because that shit's so crazy. That shit is so crazy. So I'm like really glad you have them. I know it comes with um, <laughs> I know it comes with other things, but uh, but you know what I mean. That you have them at all, I think it's like really good. It's like really blessed thing. Oh yeah, I can't. Wanting, you can't, you can't want it. Two hundred dollars in insurance and tax increase. That's just ridiculous. That is just fucking ridiculous. Thank goodness for them. Yeah. Just fucking ridiculous. I just don't. I don't understand it. Okay, back to work. Love you. Bye. Love you too. Bye. Have fun cleaning. Hope it's not too bad. Since I got mine, I just have to remember. I just have to remember because they're not on my map anymore. Where's that elite bitch? She must be behind me. Okay. <gasps> 
root me. I guess you want to die. Well, who am I to deny you? Who am I to deny you? I certainly wouldn't. Lay off, Harpy. I'm done with you guys. I'm so not used to seeing, like, the Chinese name. The, a Chinese name person just reached level 60. I'm so not used to seeing it, but, like, since this is the West Coast server that we're on now, like, I see them all the time. And the font looks like so, um, like when it has the Roman letters, the English letters with it, it's in this kind of like very specific type of font. And it always makes me go, huh, for a second. And then I'm like, oh yeah. He only needs two more. Let's see if there's this entrance spawn. <clears throat> oh, he only needs one more now. Is a spawn that's like all the way back here. I'm gonna check it. Well, the Patriarch's up. We killed him before. I think he just drops a leather piece, so not very useful for us.
Okay, yeah, this these guys aren't up. Come on, just one more elemental. Yeah, they totally need to fix the spawn rate on these. When there's a lot of people here, they just don't spawn enough. They need to they need dynamic hyper spawns for the elementals. Cuz if it's 100% drop rate for this, this is how long it's taken us just to find 20 of them, which is crazy. Haha. A few minutes of cleaning. Hello, Jane. How are you doing today? What Saturday choice have you got? We aren't dead. That's true. We're not dead yet. I really thought the charred veil was going to kill me. Um, and But it hasn't. It totally hasn't. Um, <laughs> thank you so much. Thank you. I am also amazed. I am also amazed. If we make it to 30, I'll be like so pleasantly surprised because that'll be the farthest that I've made it. Okay, where's the back way? It's like right over here, right? There we go. There's the torch. There's the torch. <clears throat> All right, we're going to head up this back path. And then once we get back up to camp, we're going to take a little stretch break and then we're going to turn everything in. So Jane, you made it just in time for funny videos for a second while I go fix a snack. Today was laundry day for us, so that was that was the chore that I did. I did it before stream. It was almost done. There's like one load still in the dryer um, that I didn't finish taking out before it was stream time, but I finished all the rest. I hung up all the shirts, you guys. That's the worst part of laundry is hanging up all the shirts, so many shirts, and you have to hang them all up. It's the worst, but I did it. What are you having for a snack? Because I can't decide what I want. So um, we have we have this frozen sushi, which sounds like it wouldn't be good, but it's from... Um, I can't remember if we order it from Wild Fork or if we order it from the BJ's, but it's really good, actually. So I'm going to fix some of that. I'll show it to you. 
like I'll show it to the camera when I when I fix it. It's actually really good. You wouldn't think like for frozen sushi, you wouldn't think it would be good, but this one is actually pretty freaking good. Now it's very simple. There's only two flavors you can get. You can get a California roll or you can get a spicy roll and it's not that spicy or anything. Um, I'll, but I'm gonna make mine spicy with some uh, sriracha uh, aioli. But anyways, okay. So we're gonna take a quick break. I'm gonna go fix a snack. I'm gonna turn all these in. We're gonna do part two of this. All right. So for those watching um, the the vod afterwards, thank you so much for watching. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below, and of course, as always, don't forget to make it a great day.